So mom thought her alcoholic behavior might rub off on me. So she put me in a foster home. That's much better, thanks mom. <laughs> Actually it was pretty cool, um, I'm pretty. People only beat the ugly kids. The molesters like the ugly kids too, because let's face it, who's gonna believe them? <laughs> oh, I was a late bloomer, come on. Um, so no, actually there's a couple of cool things about growing up in foster homes. Um, first of all, I got to be like a great actress. That's where it started. Yeah, no, seriously. I'm opening up my <laughs> Rewind. I'm opening up my crap gifts. <laughs> I'm like, oh for Christ's sakes, wow. Whoo, I'm so happy, wow, thank you. A Chia pet. <laughs> Thanks. I'm so, what, what kid doesn't want sprouts for Christmas? Thank you. <laughs> No, I'm being serious, I'm not joking. It's the goat. I don't have that one. I'm so excited, no really, it's a toy, it's a pet, and if I'm hungry later, I'll just make a salad. <laughs> Anyone give to Toys for Tots? Everyone, it's, it's what a great organization, Toys for Tots, right? Um, here's a little tip. I was a tot, I got you toys, and they suck. All right, that naked doll with the brown matted hair and the exorcist eyes. <laughs> scared me, all right? I would have liked a cabbage patch. Thanks for Chucky. <laughs> Maybe you could have spared the extra two bucks for a real Etch-A-Sketch when I could shake like this. <laughs> Not that piece of crap, cardboard crap with the up, down, up, down, up, down, sticky fly trap paper and the red pen. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> thanks for the ghetto sketch. Really appreciate it. <laughs> I wanted to draw and not catch flies. Thanks. So, yeah, if you're the only foster kid in somebody's house and somebody, something is broken, missing, or stolen, you did it. I could be, <laughs> I could be in a room with like an ex-con, a Taliban, and like Winona Ryder, and they'd still be like, okay, Tracy, empty your pockets. <laughs> and as an adult, this affects me, seriously. I went to, I went to Europe last year to see the, uh, the Venus de Milo. I took one, light, one look at those broken arms. I got the hell out of there. I'm like, where the hell are the arms? I'm already thinking of an alibi. I'm like, okay, where was I in 2000 BC? Sh crap. So anyway, I, can, I, I literally, I, saw, I feel guilty about everything. I feel guilty about everything. I, I cannot leave a store without going through those security centers without having a mild heart attack. Every time I go through them, I think they're gonna go off. I know I didn't steal anything, nothing fell in my purse, but I still think they're gonna go off. The kleptos know what I'm talking about. Every time I go through them, I look like a guilty crack, and I'm like, <laughs> yes, I made it! I could be naked walking through those sensors, and I'd still think they're gonna go off. I'm like, oh my God! 